now coming to the cross section of the hair so when you see the cross section here is the hair so this is the hair outer to the hair is the inner root sheath and then we have the outer root sheath which is enveloped by this glassy membrane also called as the hyaline membrane and surrounded by the dermal or the connective tissue sheath so this is how you see the hair when you see in the cross section the hair enveloped by the inner root sheath the outer root sheath the glassy membrane and the dermal sheath now coming to the hair this yellow colored structure here which you see so in this hair we have further three layers there is the medulla which is in the center surrounded by the cortex and the third layer of the hair is the cuticle so in the hair we have the medulla cortex and the cuticle now talking about this pink colored membrane here which is the inner root sheet the inner root sheet also has three layers and these layers are important to remember so from innermost there is the cuticle yes i just told you that a cuticle is part of the hair shaft but we also have a cuticle layer in the inner root sheet then there is the huxley layer and the henle layer so three layers of the inner root sheet the cuticle the huxley layer and the henle layer in fact the cuticle of the inner root sheet is entangled with the cuticle of the hair shaft and together it binds the hair shaft to the layers so now coming to the types of hair here we have three important types the lanigo hair villus hair and the terminal hair these lanigo hair are intra uterine hair while the villus and the terminal are the extra uterine hair interesting yes now coming to the cross section of the hair 